Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a makeup tutorial on this look right here. It was actually requested on a really old video of mine that I reposted in a Facebook group that I admin, but I did a like all black smoky eye. So here's the all black smoky eye. I used this Ulta glitter eyeshadow top coat for like that glitter because I feel like that glitter makes this perfect for New Year's Eve. So if you guys want to see how I got this look, then keep watching. Okay, so my eyebrows are done. I used my NYX Micro Brow in black. And then I just primed my eyelids with my NYX um, Full Coverage, Above and Beyond Full Coverage Concealer. Okay, so today I'm going to go in with my Tarte Lip Palette just because this has these shades I want to use. I promise I'll, like, stop using it in 2018. Like, just kidding. Who am I kidding? Like, this is one of my favorite palettes. So, I'm going to go in with this ColourPop blending brush, and I'm actually going to go in with this shade right here, which is this really pretty, like, light BB pink color, and it's called Caregiver. And I'm just going to pop this in the crease to start as my transition shade. The next shade I'm going to pick up is Caregiver and this shade right here, which is Natural Beauty, and I'm using the same brush still. And I'm just going to tap a little bit of it off and just pop this in the crease. So next, I'm going to go in with the same color pop brush and pick up Caregiver. Natural Beauty and Best Friend on the same brush. And we're just gonna pop this into the crease. Next, using the same brush again, I'm just going to pick up Caregiver, Natural Beauty, Best Friend, and the shade right here, which is Bombshell. Pretty much just using this whole entire middle row. And I'm going to pop all these shades in the crease. With this shade, um, Bombshell, I want to move slowly because it is darker. And I just feel like darker shades are harder to work with sometimes, so... Just move slowly, don't go too fast. And next, still using this ColourPop blending brush, we're just gonna go in with this whole row right here. And I'm also gonna pick up Fashionista, and I'm gonna tap it off just a little bit because Fashionista is one pigmented color. And I'm just going to pop this on the crease. With Fashionista, just work slowly. I wanted to add those like purpley shades before Fashionista because I wanted this black smoky eye to kind of have like some more color to it and not just black even though the purple shade is kind of fading away. That's okay. You could still kind of see like that brown shade that we use and a little bit of the purple. I'm sure you already know what I'm going to do next. I'm going to go in with my Anastasia Beverly Hills brush and I'm just going to really buff out these edges because they are a tad bit harsh looking. Next up, going in with this like flat shader brush, I'm just going to go in with this shade right here, which is Fashionista. We use this on the crease, and I'm just going to pop this all over the lid. Fashionista does have a little bit of fallout, so just be careful. If you're ever working with black, I would do your foundation after you're done with your eyes, just so it doesn't get all messed up. I'm just going to go back in with this Anastasia brush just to kind of blend the crease and the lid shade together just to make sure it kind of just all flows nicely. 
next up for the fun part so this just isn't like a basic black smoky eye i'm gonna go in with this ulta glitter eyeshadow top coat and i'm gonna use this shade right here which i think is high maintenance but before i use it i'm gonna use my finger to apply it and i'm just gonna spray a little bit of fix plus on there and just rub my finger and i'll swatch like this is what it looks like it's black and there's like some really pretty colors in there i'll swatch it for you so you can kind of see it but there's like blues and greens and silvers i noticed that this works best if your finger is wet so that's what i'm gonna do and i'm just going to pat this all over the eye this look not look so you know dark and dramatic i'm gonna go in with this urban decay 24 7 glide on eye pencil in the shade voodoo and i'm just going to pop this in my waterline And then to finish up the lower lash line, I'm just going to take all the colors that we used in the crease. I'm not going to bring it down far. I'm going to keep it pretty close to the lash line. Alright, so I just cleaned up my face. There's a ton of fallout. And I also just cleaned up the outer corners a little bit. And now I'm just going to go finish up the rest of my face and I'll be back to do the lips with you guys. Okay, so I just finished up the rest of my face and now we're going to move on to lips. And I just like lost the lip product. I found it. So for lipstick, I'm going to go in with this combo of the Dose of Colors Desi X Katie No Shade Lipstick. And I'm going to put um, Madeline, the NYX Butter Gloss, on top. that is it for today's tutorial i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to hit that red button down below to subscribe to my channel follow me on all my social media that's always linked down below in the description box if you guys have any video suggestions on any video you want to see let me know in the comments down below or if you just want to leave a comment saying hey please do that too i love getting your comments if you guys are going out for new year's eve i hope you have a fun time stay safe and that is all I have to say, so I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!